professional bull riding event is coming to Huntington this weekend and I caught up with Tazwell Virginia native and professional bull rider Michael Lane to get all the info and more. You know, bull riding it started with just a group of cowboys who said they wanted to go ride a bull and those 12 took their money and started what is today now called the PBR and it's the, the PBR is the top 35 best bull riders in the world at the Premier Series. And then from like 35 to 75 is at the Velocity Tour. And um, so for us to get on the, the Major League Tour, which would be called the Unleash the Beast Tour, we'd have to do good at the Velocity Tour events to work our way up to get to go there. Okay, you are currently 47th in the world. There's plenty of bull riders out there, and you're kind of ahead of head of the pack there. Um, you're a 10-year veteran, so how does it feel to kind of be ranked there? I, I have goals always staying inside the top 35, but I've had a lot of injuries that I've had to go through. And, and this year, luckily, no major injuries, but I've had injuries that set me out for a couple of months and, and keep me from getting to where I need to go, so... That's a lot of the reason I'm not inside the top 35 right now. And um, this year I'm riding 60% of my bulls, so which is like a, a high ride percentage for me or for any guy to be able to ride 60% in a year. Is, I just keep trying to make that percentage of how many rides I make go up every year. Okay, awesome. You've, Like I said, you've been in um, kind of the industry for about 10 years now. What made you want to get into bull riding? So... The PBR was founded in 1992, and I was born in 90, so I was real young. And at the age of four, I started riding sheep at his events. I seen I went there and I seen the little kids ride sheep. So I, I came back home. My siblings had some show sheep, and I started riding sheep. And then a few years went by, and I realized about the PBR. And once I seen the PBR, I was down and determined I wanted to be a professional bull rider and I kept my face strong and, and believed in myself and, and not that I've made it anywhere today just it's uh I still have a lot more to go from from what I've already done. Kind of walk us through those eight seconds yeah. when you get Come onto on. the bull and as soon as the eight second clock starts we're not we'll never be able to experience something like that so kind of walk us through kind of what you your thoughts and your feelings are right before you ride that bull. I'm a very sociable guy uh, outside the arena and stuff but on game day i have a certain routine and uh that i follow and i stick to that every game day when it comes time to walk into that arena you just you kind of you know that you've worked hard all week and you've put a lot of hours of training in so you know you deserve to win and at that point you just you expect that when you walk in that door that it's time to block everything out all the other competitors all of the cameras all the lights just you and your time that you've worked so hard to get, and uh, you just have to stay really calm and focused. So, you know, just leading up to that moment when you're about to get on, it's just kind of you and, and that quiet quiet before the storm, you know, and I always seem just to think, you know, someone has to win, why not me? And I always just use positive vibes and positive quotes to, to think to myself in that moment. I never want to be thinking about the, the situation really at hand. I just want to be clear-minded. Awesome. Um, let's talk about your dreams. You're obviously following your dreams right now, but where do you want to? Where do you see yourself in the next couple of years um, with bull riding? God willing, um, I'd love to be able to ride another five more years professionally, and and make the world finals every year, and uh, ultimately be a world champion. I mean, that pays us a million dollars. So. If I can get a world title under my belt before before I retire, that would be great. And all you need is a little bit of confidence and determination to keep going. Because in this sport, we we lose a lot more and we win. That's the unfortunate thing. But as long as you don't look at it as winning or losing, you just look at it as I have to show up. I have to ride whatever bulls they put under me. And that's my job. May it fall where it falls. What's it like when you go out in front of your friends and family and compete? It's very bittersweet. Um, my, my family supports me. My wife is very supportive. I have a very strong support group behind me that I don't think I would be able to be where I am today without.
Let's talk about event in Huntington this weekend. Let's kind of tell everyone out there um, when it is, where it is, what time to be there. Yes, ma'am. Um, the Huntington Invitational is located at the Big Sandy Superstore Arena. It's September 28th at 8 o'clock, September 29th at 7 o'clock, and you can buy tickets starting at just $15 at Ticketmasters.com. Okay. Anything else you kind of want to say to uh, the listeners out there to kind of tell them about bull riding or anything about you? Yeah, for sure. Come check out uh, Action Pack Night uh, bull riding that will keep you on the edge of your seat all night long. You never know what's going to be around the corner. Come see one of the world's best entertainers, Matt Merritt. He'll be there keeping you entertained when as we're not riding, so there's never no boring or or dead time and they also give away a fan of the night buckle um so so for the bull rider that wins we get a belt buckle for for the fan of the night that matt merritt picks out they get a belt buckle so that's something for all the fans to look forward to and uh come come hollering and come clapping because uh you want to win that fan of the night buckle okay awesome that's all i needed i appreciate you taking the time out of your day to speak with me Yes, ma'am, for sure. And I hope you have a great evening. Thank you. Good luck this weekend and good luck in your future endeavors.